Ready? Go. Nice looking rainbow road is ish. But this is probably gonna be a pain. Like if the last world wasn't already. I'm gonna jump over here. Try that. Ready? You know what? I'm actually gonna switch. If I fail this one, this one more time. I don't know what's going on. We. Okay. I'll take it. I don't care if that was stupidly slow. Ready, go. Oh. This is actually gonna be fun. Whoa! Okay. Best to avoid that. Ready? Go. The speed this this dude has is ridiculous. Yeah, no. <laughs>
Stop! 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 Okay. Okay. <laughs> it's finally... It's finally time. It's finally final boss time. Okay, so this guy doesn't want to get hit in the bar. That's good to know. 
Let's do this. Fortunately, you can't change can't change the character before going into a boss, and okay. Wow. Alright. Here's what I'm gonna do. Baby. Because... Ready? I can just quickly do it. Down. No. no. Okay, this is not working. Hold on. Ah! Alright. Yeah. Just keep getting his crotch. Two more, maybe. No! Oh, you have to do the whole thing again. That's crap. works. Oh dear. Never again. Yes. 
Alright. Oh. I was trying to move. Well, whatever. Let's see if anything happens now. Nope. Okay, well, yeah, I was right. I think. I probably was anyway. Like, how you have to get through all the worlds without doing any, having any continues. But screw that. I'm never going to do that. That's not going to happen. If you want to see an actual good run and you see like the two bonus worlds, go see the AGDQ run. I'll put a link to, to it in the description and you can see all these levels that I've spent so long struggling through uh, be done in like two seconds. So yeah, if you want to see an actual good run, run of the game, go there. As for final thoughts, just to quickly say I, I'm t way too exhausted to do like a really long-winded final thoughts so I'm just gonna say I enjoyed half of the game the second half was just a huge difficulty spike for me um, maybe it's just because of the fact that I suck but it's also the fact that motion controls weren't always the best the camera didn't really work the, the best sometimes because it always when you're trying to move around, it's kind of awkward because like, it it always goes like goes behind the character for the most part, and you can't move it whatsoever. Um, uh, the collision detection is terrible because it just you kind of just bonk, bonk on everything sometimes, and that got frustrating as hell. Um, and just some of the level design just feels really cheap to me. I I don't know if it's just me though, but I just kind of feel like it's a bit over the top at times and just really un unfair like it feels like they weren't really thinking much about how the motion controls would work in correlation to a lot of the level design most of the time but I mean it's a fine enough game for the most part but the on the second half there be prepared for a lot of frustration because that there were times when I just wanted to flat out quit, but hey, we finished it now, so I'm ha happy about that. Again, if you want to see an actual good run of the game and see the two extra worlds, go check out the AGDQ version, which will be in the description down below, and you'll probably learn something or two from that, because you probably sure as hell didn't learn anything from this run. <laughs> so uh, yeah, with that said... I've been Super Mario Sonic Lover, and I'll see you guys next time for something that's... L Actually, no. I've got to record Zelda 2 next. So, yeah. Maybe it won't be as frustrating as this, but knowing that game, not likely. But, I mean, it's still a fun game, I think. I, uh, but either way, see you guys later. Peace.